Oh, nice view this evening. <laughs> Hi, everybody. How are you? Sorry, I was just getting a frog out of the house. <laughs> I wondered what it was. <laughs> I didn't have my glasses on. I thought it was a leaf. <laughs> it moved. Um, let me just get this up and I can see his head. Updates, there we go. Hi Kate, hi Gems, hi Chris, hi Felicia, hi Arthur, hi Gems, hi Helen. I'm just going through, I don't say hi Jane. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Glenda Baker. <laughs> hello, 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 hello. Um, I'm going to paint um, these today, Japanese and Enemies, I think they're called. I'm not sure what their officialis name is <laughs> in Latin, but you get them in pink, I think, as well. They're in pink, something like that. But these are from my garden. And I was just counting the petals. I've got seven petals, which is, I don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hi Joe. Hi Jane. Did I say the other? This is the other Jane. There was a Jane with a Y and a Jane within a just an N. <laughs> well, they both got N and Jane with a Y and Jane without. <laughs> oh yeah, white flowers. <laughs> I thought I had some pink ones. I was I was going for the pink ones, but no, but yeah, I'm going to paint the white flowers. <laughs> Hi Anna, is that right? Yeah. <laughs> so they are quite pretty. Um, the paper I've got is this Hammer New, <laughs> and it's a hundred and forty pound rough cold press, and it's in a gummed block. Although it doesn't stay down very well, this one for some reason, it's really rough. This one, like rough, 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 rough. So I'm not sure if that's going to help me, but it was just sat here. Well, I was doing some stuff yesterday, so that's how lazy I am. <laughs> yeah. I'm going walking this morning, which will be nice when I finish this. I need to, I think. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit sad. I'm feeling a bit sad this morning. Um, let me zoom in a bit so you don't have to see everything. A bit level. It's gone wonky wonky. Can't tighten it up anymore. That's because I keep pulling it with my headphones, my thing on. <laughs> yeah, a walk will make me feel better. Be good to get out on the hills. My elbow is still killing me. I don't know what. It's swollen up so much. I've got like an extra elbow groan <laughs> from whatever bit me when I was in the lakes. Uh, Probably just a mosquito. <laughs> um, I haven't got clean water. Well, it's fairly clean because I changed it yesterday. Didn't I? <laughs> yeah, I've got big cobwebs to blow away, but it's not windy. <laughs> oh. Hi, Isa. Hi Melanie, did I say hello Melanie? Um, I need to roll my sleeve up otherwise I'm going to um, Sorry, itch, itch, oh, I feel so good. <laughs> I need to elbow itch. Uh, oh. It's on my right hand as well and it's an arm and it's annoying me. <laughs> oh, hello Rachel, sorry I missed you. <laughs> hi Sue, did I say hi Sue? No, no. Hello everybody. Right, I'm going to start painting. Right, I'm painting white flowers. Oh, these have got a little bit of pink in them. But I'm not going to paint them sort of like that, how they are. I'm going to do, I might do one or two sort of that. But I'm going to paint like it face on, sort of looking at it. Like it's maybe been blown over by the wind. You can make it up if you're um, painting, which is good. Um, what I usually do 
for white flowers is just paint them in dirty palette paint <laughs> like really um sort of a bluey gray like but, but really pale sometimes i put it on and it's not pale enough um this paper is quite small actually i think it's a little smaller than a4 size I'm going to start painting. <laughs> I'm just getting my hair out of the way. Ah, uh, yeah. So here we go. That's the first petal. And you see, it's just watery. Yeah, these are white flowers, but I'm painting them in a dirty colour. Dirty. I'm going to put a bit of pink in because they, they have got a bit of pink. I'm using that bit of that um, cobalt violet that I had yesterday, which is quite nice. Let's try and get all the petals in. You probably can't see, but then I come in and do some... It's a bit like when I paint the anemones, white anemones. And I, I will do the, um, the details of them later. I hope you can see that. It's quite pale. Oh, thank you, Anne. <laughs> Morning. I did another one after um, I came off air, and it's on up on Etsy. So if anybody wants a sweet pea similar, so I'll show you that. It's here. It's a bigger one. Sweeter peas. There we go. I'll fit it all in. <laughs> Yeah, there's a better picture on Etsy if you. <laughs> um, they have like a brownie yellow stem, these guys. So I'm going to make brownie yellow. Quinacridone yellow is quite good for that. So, so I'm just going to sort of make it up. These ones, the petals have all fallen off. But they're quite pretty. They'll be quite delicate, I think. I think I'm going through a, a delicate stage of painting again. <laughs> tend to do that and then they have the leaves at the bottom where they join I think I always paint quite delicately when I'm painting from life sort of thing it's weird it's dropping a bit of darker in Oh, thank you, Minnie. Yeah, I had a great time with my baskets. It was fun. Drank too much, ate too much, laughed too much. <laughs> it's just what I needed. And I got dumped as well, which is really good. <laughs> By text. Can you believe it? having too much of a good time. <laughs> oh, thank you, Anne. Yeah, via text. <laughs> Great, isn't it? <laughs> Again, this is the second time, third time. Oh, I lost count. Stupid man. <laughs> He's obviously not ready for a relationship. It's quite funny, really. <laughs> Oh, that's all right, Anne-Marie. Don't worry. Um, I can't say too much here. <laughs> but that wasn't that person. <laughs> Hi, Noreen! <laughs> Yeah, ass. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> mm, yeah. 
it was all about him anyway. Me, 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 me. me. Yeah, I know. And I get a message again. Can you still be my friend? <laughs> be my friend. Yeah, all right, whatever. This is this bit I'm painted there, so it goes down into another one. But I was trying to, um, I'm gonna put another flower head here, but one or not, maybe. I don't know, I really love the centers of them, so I want to paint the centers. But the way they grow, they're quite spacey outy, and um, you can see they're like in really long stems, so that you wouldn't get loads of heads together necessarily. But I might add an extra in. I don't know, Aunt Marie. Some people. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Well, that's another flower that, sorry, you can't see. <laughs> yeah, break time. <laughs> Melon. It's cool. Oh, see. I don't know. I don't know if it was like actually in a really proper relationship anyway, so um it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's just sad. <laughs> Terribly sad. Quite like being single. You can just do what you want when you want. Adding a little bit of dark there. And I might put an extra one in. I'm just trying to make them look. I'm going to put another flower head here, but one facing upwards. And then I'm going to work in the centre bit. Oh, thank you, Anne Marie. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. No, it hasn't. This one's sort of facing upwards, but you can't really see it. I, you won't seal it properly until I put some shadowy bits in. <laughs> Let me give it a stem, and it might look like it's. Um, you can tell where it is. And this has got a bud coming up here. So it's just that one again, but I'm doing it in a different. Oops. Got some leaves, yeah, some darker leaves, little leaves come from the join. I don't know if I've given it seven petals, I just haven't counted. <laughs> you can't see them all anyway. Right, that's sort of the composition, I think. Ha ha ha! 
<laughs> That's good, Kerry. Sorry, I just love that. <laughs> Men. That wasn't supposed to be green. I thought I had grey on my brush for some reason, but that would do. That would be green. Right, um, I'm going to add some darker um, bits. Darker bits. <laughs> I'm using this um, a mixture of um, lunar black and a bit of um, blue and a bit of... <laughs> I'm not sure what... I think that's a sort of a Daniel Smith green. <gasps> I'm not quite sure, but I just want to make a, I don't want it to be too black because it's the flower, but I was just going to make it so that you can see some, so I could probably do lots of brush licking in this. Um, I'm not getting too bogged down with the details, I'm just adding in a few little shadowy bits. Oh, sorry, I'm just reading the chat. I'm just trying to keep up. Oh, Kate, you painting? <laughs> it's good to try new things. Do it. It's like I loved, absolutely loved basket making. Uh, I think it was like the rhythm. Like once I'd sort of got it, first of all, I was like, what? And then she came over and showed me because I'm not very good if someone just talks. I need to be um, a visual, visually shown how to do stuff. And then I'm like, ah, oh! and then I just pick it up. I was, I was like that at school. If, if I was in a lesson where they just talked all the time, I was just like, I can cope with that. <laughs> I never learned anything. Um, I probably why I'm not very good at languages. Well, I can sort of understand French and that, and understand German, but I can't talk it. And it's a confidence thing, I think. But um, I'm so much easier if you, someone shows you, sort of sit down in front of you and goes, this is what you do. <laughs> Joe, I just read your thing. <laughs> you tried a willow chicken. It was shit. <laughs> oh well, she <you> tried. <laughs> Does it look like a chicken? <laughs> so I'm, I'm just adding some very delicate um, shadows in because they're quite delicate flowers, and I don't want to lose. The, the delicacy of them, if you get what I mean. So, it's very pale, but it looks nice. And I'm going to add yellow bits around the middle, <laughs> these, the um, stamens. Right word, well done. Well, it's cheering me up coming on here. I wasn't going to do it this morning. I was like, <laughs> Right, I've got a yellow pencil crayon. Oh, so I threw my pencil shot now on the floor. <laughs> Happy 
to show you French. <laughs> How does that work, Chris? <laughs> I think, um, yeah, watching people talk is probably the way I'll pick it up better. <laughs> <laughs> Result to Jake's now I'm okay. It's all good. I'm happy now. <laughs> it's just a lot of stuff that sort of happened over the last week and then I had that and then I was just like, oh. <laughs> oh. It's just like the cherry on the top of how much one can handle for the week. And I was having such a good time. Right, this is just a yellow pencil crayon. Um, watercolour pencil crayon, so when it gets a little bit wet, it goes, my favourite word, smooshy. <laughs> Ooh, Anne Marie, good luck with that. Is that where they have to put it? I'm not going to ask which end they put that. Which way is it? <laughs> Both ends. <laughs> Never touch wood. Never had an operation, touch wood or anything. Yes. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Helen. It's lovely. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Just need to add a little bit of shadow round here. They're quite yellow the middles, yellowy green. But um just adding a little bit of shadow just to make it pop a bit. Ah, oh, thank you. Oh, that's the one that goes up. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> I didn't like that bit there. So it was a dark bit. I missed rid of it. Let's do this one. Try and do it so you can see. <laughs> yeah, this is just a uh, Faber Castle Art Grip Aquilau, and it's got these like funny knobblies. It's, it's got these knobbly bits in that on it, but um, they're a bit fancy. We don't really need all that fancy stuff on them, I don't know, but they are nice. They these are the pencils that when I go into an art shop, I just buy one of here and there. I haven't been into an art shop for ages though. Oh, I did, I tell a lie, I did go into um, Sea White's in Brighton. I went down to Sussex, but they don't have these pencils like all on display for singly. You have to buy packs of stuff. I like it when you can like buy single pastels and things like that. Just makes you go, ooh. <laughs> Put a bit of shadow on this. Around the fear, so it doesn't look like it's. I'm not sure where the light's coming from on this. Down. <laughs> anyway. Put a little bit of shadow on these things, the bud things. Well, they're not buds, they're the ones that have been. The petals. Petals? Oh god, the petals <laughs> have all um, come off. A little bit of shadow. 
Um, yeah. Put a little bit more shadow at the bottom of this one. So it stands out. I'm about to hear me gasp then. <laughs> Yeah, that was okay. It's just made it pop out a little bit. Sometimes you can have quite drastic shadows and um, it works. And then other times you can not. <laughs> you sort of have to, have to. God, what's wrong with me? Have to <laughs> um, adjust the shadows as the painting dry because the watercolour um, dries lighter. So when it's dry, this is sort of dry now because it's so lightly done. It's not really wet and wet. It's quite detailed for me this morning. There. Anyway, that's that done. <laughs> oh, thank you, Millie. <laughs> yeah, so um, that's these. It looks a bit like how they grow. I don't know. Thing. <laughs> I could put a background on it, but I'm a bit scared, so I'm not going to. Where's Halls? I don't know where that is, Kate. Can't spare dahlias. <laughs> no, I don't often put a background on white flowers. That's why I paint them like not white, but they still look white. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Normally, I'd put um, like a a leaf around a few of the petals, but because these are so um, the character of the flowers, they're like standalone. I can't really put something behind it unless it's like really in the background. But um, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna leave it like that because I like how it looks. <laughs> Halls of Hedden dot com. All right, I will shall have looks. <laughs> All right, thank you, everybody. I've got to go and get my skates on now because I've got to drive up to Middleton Teesdale for a walk. <laughs> With me, mate. And have a rant. A walk and a rant, it's always good. Right, there. Finished, thank you. Thank you for joining me, everybody. Have a lovely time. Hope it all goes well, Anne Marie. Oh, it's not today, is it? Anyway, <laughs> it's been a few days to think about it. <laughs> thank you for joining me I'll put this up on Etsy sometime when I get round to it I put one up yesterday yay me <laughs> right. thanks for joining me I, I will see you tomorrow bye